Cross District 62 out of Tuscaloosa County. Okay, now, hold on just a second before we move to any motions like that. We have already passed a motion, I know, but you passed it with a majority vote that said we would fill the seats which were read out and we would carry the other seats over to the next meeting. Now, we, you know, you would have to reconsider every nominee since that was a group motion. So, um, she is asking that we reconsider every nominee on here and every vote that has been taken thus far. I'm asking, my motion is to reopen only House District 62. Well, because we, we had a motion to adopt 62 females and all that. And, and we then had a motion to carry over all the others. So I'm asking, I'm asking, do you wish to reopen? All those in favor of reopening all these, please say aye. Aye. All opposed, no. No. Okay, the no's have. Moving down to the election of office. Now, we are going to proceed. That was one information. Yes, sir. Claire. And I come here myself to be fair with everybody. I had an African American person that I was going to nominate in District 27. I didn't get afforded that opportunity to nominate that person. I've been involved with the Voters League almost 30 years. I've been on the school board 27 years, a pastor church in Antioch, and we pour the practice fairness. That's right. I, I, I can't even nominate somebody even look like me <laughs> for this district. Now, there's something wrong there. Now, I, I, I'm going to be fair with you. I came here to nominate this young man, and I don't have an opportunity to do that. This word. You know me. I'm about what's right regardless. And we, I didn't get that opportunity to do that. And so we're talking about a democracy that's for everybody. And everybody should have that opportunity, just like we vote. Everybody has the right to vote who they want. Thank you. Thank you. Now, Madam Chair, I have a motion. Hang on, Justin. We have an extremely long agenda. We could spend the rest of the day with people, you know, arguing back and forth on this issue. The chair has ruled. It has been challenged. You have sustained the decision of the chair. We have voted on the individuals nominated. We have opened the floor for nominations. Now, we simply cannot continue on with this discussion. I understand, I understand what you're saying. I am not disagreeing with you. I am simply saying that when the motion was made, we presented that to you and a majority of you voted for it. You have made the decision. We've now even had a motion really to reconsider. Do you wish to go back and reopen this? And you voted that day. So we are not going to deal with this anymore. If you brought a name here, you need to bring that person's name back at the next meeting. Thank you. Now we are moving to the election of officers. Madam right? Chair, I have a motion to amend the motion that was previously passed no, to, add, to add District 25 female you and District 62 female. Just That's a motion to amend. No. And a motion to amend is not in order. It has to be made while the main motion is on the floor. Well, I have a motion to uh, take to, to fill vacancies and take nominations for District 25 female and District 62 female only. That only is, those two districts. That is the same motion that Ms. Ryan made. And she, that, she that's not the same motion, number. Madam Chair. And unfortunately, we're not, not going to entertain that. I would like to appeal that decision, Madam Chair. The appeal has been made to override the chair's decision and your vote. Uh, as you well know, you voted not to reconsider and to proceed on. So, I'll name one in a little bit if we, if we get to them. Uh, now, ladies and gentlemen, a second appeal has been made. 
All those in favor of sustaining or agreeing with the chair and your vote, please say aye. aye. All opposed, no. No. Okay, let's stand up one more time. We're going to Okay, now, all those in favor of sustaining or agreeing with the chair and your vote, please stand up with your green cards. Please stand. Thank you. Please be seated. All those opposed, please stand up. Thank you. Very pleased. Moving on. Madam Chair, I have uh, a point of personal privilege to make some comments to this spot about the way we are behaving. Okay. Not only the people out here, but the people up there. My name is Carol Gowan. I'm from District 81, Tallapoosa County. I've been on this committee for a number of years. I've been a Democrat all my life. And I am sick and tired of coming here and hearing us debate minutia, not work together. We just had a conversation, a speech from Dr. Reed about working together, and now we're in all this mess. Yes. We come here as individuals. We are not white Democrats. We are not black Democrats. We are not lesbian or gay Democrats. We are Democrats, and we need to start acting like Democrats. privilege or question or comment, you can hold those to the announcements. Moving to the election of officers.